morning office for August 20th. Hallelujah. How good it is to sing praises to our God. How pleasant it is to honor Him with praise. Hear the voice of my prayer when I cry out to you, when I lift up my hands to your Holy of Holies. It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord and to sing praises to your name, O Most High, to tell of your loving kindness early in the morning and of your faithfulness in the night season. For we are your people and the sheep of your pasture. We will give you thanks forever and show forth your praise from age to age. The morning reading is taken from John's Gospel, chapter 10, verses 7 through 9. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Jesus taught us, saying, In all truth I tell you, I am the gate of the sheepfold. All who have come before me are thieves and bandits, but the sheep took no notice of them. I am the gate, and anyone who enters through me will be safe. Such one will go in and out and will find pasture. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. For we are your people and the sheep of your pasture. We will give you thanks forever and show forth your praise from age to age. The morning psalm is read from Psalms chapter 23. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He revives my soul and guides me along the right pathways for his name's sake. Though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You spread a table before me in the presence of those who trouble me. You have anointed my head with oil, and my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. For we are your people and the sheep of your pasture. We will give you thanks forever and show forth your praise from age to age. O oh God, come to my assistance. O oh Lord, make haste to help me. Our Father, who is in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Almighty God, who has given your only Son to be unto us both a sacrifice for sin, and also an example of his godly life, give me grace that I may always most thankfully receive that his inestimable gift and also daily endeavor myself to follow the blessed steps of his most holy life. This same, your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Lord God Almighty and Everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose. Through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen.